learn HTML, that's great. HTML is the building block of the web and it's the first thing that you have to learn in order to build a website. But the question is, what is HTML, how does it work, and where did it come from? Let's start by looking at how it works. You can think of it like a name tag or a label for every part of your website. When you pull up a web page, you see images and text. When your computer pulls up a web page, it sees text and HTML tags, which tell it what kind of content the text is. So let's take a look at some HTML. It looks a little weird, but I'm sure that there are some parts that you recognize. That's because HTML is made up of HTML tags and text. These are some HTML tags. This is some text. Tags, text, you get the idea. The tags are for your computer. The text is for you or anyone who's looking at your site. If it looked like gibberish, don't worry. You have to remember you are learning a new language, so don't put too much pressure on yourself to understand it all right away. Luckily, there are only about 100 HTML tags total and really only about 25 that you're gonna be using all of the time to add stuff like images, paragraphs, articles, footers, sections, that kind of stuff to your website. Let's start with some of the most frequently used tags for text. Take a look at this chunk of text. There's a big bold header right at the top. This headline is the most important headline on the page, so it uses the H1 tag. The deal with all the header tags, which go from H1 to H6, is that the number tells your web browser how important that header is. Is it the most important headline on the page? Make it an H1. Then, if you want to add another headline to the page that's less important than the H1, or if you want subheaders in your article, you use the H2 or H3 tags. If you want a headline that's less important than H1, H2, or H3, you could use H4, H5, or H6. H6 is as unimportant as headline tags go. If you have some text and it's less important than H6, then it's probably not a header and you should probably give it a different type of HTML tag. The rest of the text will fall between two P or paragraph tags. Now within any text tag, such as a P tag or a header tag, you can emphasize bits of text. You have two options to do this. The strong tag or the EM tag. The strong tag is meant to denote text that is important. Usually text tagged with a strong tag is bold, but not always. Use this tag when you want some portion of the text to be called out. The EM tag is used to denote text that should be emphasized. Usually text tagged with the EM tag is italicized. But again, not always. Use this tag when you want some portion of text to be emphasized. To recap, the basic tags you need for text are H1 through H6, P tags, strong, and BM tags. Now get out there and start tagging.